Around the world, the Virtual Robotics Toolkit is being used for competitive and classroom robotics. Major learning advantages have been experienced by teachers and students when using our simulator to enhance their robotics activities. Developed in Canada, this software enables students to learn and practice robotics fundamentals, such as coding, early mechanical engineering, and creative problem solving. Just like pilots use flight simulators before getting into a plane, students can learn in larger groups with the VRT before working with a physical robot. Designed to enhance the LEGO Mindstorms experience, our high-quality graphics are comparable to real-life programming scenarios and accurately represent the robot's physical challenges. What we're trying to do is to see if there's a way to engage kids. You know, China is a big country, so what we need to do is reach kids in different corners of China and see if we can bring them together. And we thought of maybe Cognition is the tool to do it. Due to the simulator's accuracy and overall ease of use, the competitive robotics world has embraced the VRT as a vital tool for the off-season. Teams in the World Robotic Olympiad feel simulators could be influential to competition outcomes. We really like how Cognition and Virtual Robotics Toolkit has the virtual brick. We've used that to take screenshots and show kids what the screen should look like when we do a lesson that requires using the the EV3 screen, it's really hard when you have a huge class to show it on an EV3 brick this small. When you have the Virtual Robotics Toolkit, you're able to show what's on the screen. Considering how many students around the world love robotics and how important the associated skills are to their educational development, it's possible that simulated competitions could soon be the next level of international competitive robotics. It's quite amazing. Uh, how well you can actually replicate uh, the real life challenges inside the simulated environment in Cognition software. So I have really great hopes for, for this to become like a new feature uh, within WL.